Peace family, out the box media. This video will be about the false notion that the new year is January 1st. And now in actuality, uh, all the holidays are false. You know, all these holidays are uh, in worship of pagan gods and, you know, deities, pagan deities. And um, first of all, as uh, Unger's, Unger's Bible Dictionary, it states that God is not a, even a divine title and it should have never been used to replace the creator's name in the first place. That Unger's Bible's dictionary actually states this, that God is not a divine title and it, it should have never been used to replace the creator's name. So God is actually, as, an, as you know, God is a dog backwards. So at the end of the day, you, you know, a dog can be what the, the, the dog, the dog God or the Egyptian dog God. You know, Beerus is, you know, uh, uh, they, as they call him, Lord Beerus on, on Dragon Ball Z. Uh, they, and they, uh, his name was actually Anubis, uh, Anubis, or whatever you ever have you want to pronounce it. So you can look at dog as being that particular type of deity or whatever. But in all actuality, God is not a divine title. Like I said, going backwards, it's dog. God is, is just a title that was put forth by, the, by Satan to fool the masses because anything can be named a god anybody can go over to you know you can go over to england right now and become a lord you know and get sworn in because you pay to pay to get sworn in and become a lord you know anything can be a lord or a god but satan knew this so that's why satan hides under the disguise under the, the uh the disguise as a god under the identity as a god and at the same time taking the identity of the creator yahweh out of the mouths of the people as the scripture stated so as, as the scripture states so with that being said i have a video on this and it is actually called um the true meaning of god all right so you guys check that out and be sure to check, check that out now um this is called a true meaning of god my bible truth explained series you know uh now as you know this won't be a this will not be a short video it'll be short and to the point because there's not really much to say about the whole new year's thing is this is a false it's a false New Year's, what have you. It's a false New Year's, and actually, is is the twenty fifth is not even uh, the Savior's birthday as well. Let's get off into that. I've been, I have a video as on that as well about Christmas, but the twenty fifth, of course, is not the Savior's birthday. It was too cold to be, this, you know, for the for a child to be born, and you know, and it said that they was, you know, they was tending to the flock, what have you, to the sheep, what have you. So it was no tending to no sheep at that time, but it was it was tending to the sheep around the time Messiah born was born, which is probably maybe late summer you know early anywhere from late summer to early fall or what have you you know middle of you know mid fall probably early fall i ain't gonna say mid fall early fall because it still was kind of nice outside over there in you know in jerusalem you know so <clears throat> the messiah could have been born on december 25th the december 25th and all these cold holidays are for these cold blooded gods these cold deities you know that that uh that are surface you know that are worship by the masses today you know uh, uh, these different gods that are worshiped by the masses and like i said the 25th is you know the messiah was definitely wasn't born on 25th and it has nothing to do with the messiah and has everything to do with the sun god all right with the, the, with the sun god the new sun god of course is jesus um these these sun gods go all the way back to ancient egypt and things like that ancient greece you know things like that so the new sun god of course is jesus now you know the new pagan sun god is jesus christ that is a new sun god that's being worshipped right now, and that's the birth date of the sun god uh, on that day. And I break these down in different, you know, different series in my Bible Truth Explained series too, as well. But uh, we're gonna get off into who is what is who is the god that's being worshipped on January first. January first, the god is the god Janus, the two-faced god, the two-headed god, which is Janus, which is you know, which is where, of course where they get the, the, the two-sided coin from, or what have you, whatever you want to call it, the two-faced god. Is the god janice and as you can see it sounds like january the god janice that's the god that's being worshipped on january 1st and all the other all the months the name of the months all the, the the name of the planets all the name of the days of the week are all named after gods all named after gods this is why we know that that we can tell this is why the creator is not a god because the creator 
it will, can be associated with gods because how will you be able to distinguish the creator from the other gods? That's why he is not a god. He's 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 never been referred to as God. The Messiah always referred to him as his heavenly father or something like that or the most high or anything like that. He's never been referred to as a god. He's much more powerful than the god. And the real new year, the actual new year is when the spring comes in, which makes sense. It, <clears throat> the spring comes in and the new new vegetation and new plants and things like that, the, the new the new growth, the new the new year. That is the new year when the spring comes in. The actual new year is the spring. That's the new year, guys. So this this new year, this is a false new year, and it's being celebrated, you know, just along like any other other guys are being celebrated. And that's what that was a little breakdown of actual New Year's. And you guys gotta stop celebrating these holidays, you know. Then when the new year comes in, it just comes in to me. I don't do a countdown or anything like that, you know. People tell me happy new year, I just nod and say, you know, the same as you because I know, you know, the you know, my people perish because of lack of knowledge. And that's what it boils down to. So you guys be safe out there. The new year is spring and the new uh that's the new vegetation that comes in. That that that's what it is. Yeah, the new the new year is spring and it's not it's not it's not January first. Okay? That's what it boils down. One day is from sun up to sundown, and that's the actual day, and the actual day is not it's been over with. It's it's not over with it. it the day doesn't begin at twelve AM. You know, uh this things has been changed by the you know, of course by the by the beast, you know, this beastly system has changed this uh, you know, exactly what the scripture says is gonna change everything, you know. The, um that's basically what happened. So actual day is from sun up to sundown, and the actual new year is from you know, it's when the spring comes in, which makes sense, you know, it's when the new vegetation come in. A day, you can tell the days, you know, the day is over with because the sun sets, all right? And that's, and you tell the day begins because the sun, you know, comes up. So, you guys, like, comment, subscribe. Be safe out there. Peace and blessings.